Numbers are beautiful and yes, they do have physical appearances. Let me give you some glimpse of it. We'll begin with one. The idea of representing numbers by points in a plane has been a very old practice, which dates back at least to the Greeks. So here we are representing one by this point. Now let's add one more to it. You will get two. Add one more to it. You'll get three. Add one more. You'll get four. Add one more. You'll get five. Add one more. You'll get six. So here we have the first six natural numbers. That is one, two, three, four, five, six. Now let's try to connect the dots. So you have one plus two. Then you have one plus two plus three. Then you have one plus two plus three plus four. Then you have one plus two plus three plus four plus five. And then you have one plus two plus three plus four plus five plus six. They seem to be suggesting that they are making a triangle. So can we call them triangular numbers? So let's see the first one. The first triangular number can be called one because we see a triangle is embedded in it. Now let's add one plus two. So we can see the second triangular number is one plus two. What about one plus two plus three? Can we call them our third triangular number? And what about the fourth triangular number? Can we call it the sum of first four natural numbers? And the fifth triangular number is sum of first five natural numbers. And in the same way, the sixth triangular number can be called as the sum of first six natural number. Now my question is, what exactly the sixth triangular number is? So let's try to convert this equilateral triangle into a right angle triangle, something like this. Is it still representing the sixth triangular number? Yes, of course, because this right angle triangle is also making 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6. Now I want you to make a copy of it, something like this, and rotate it. So now you got two copies of sixth triangular number. Let's try to align them together. So here, these two triangular numbers, the six triangular numbers, are building a rectangle. Let's see what's the dimension. On the vertical side, we have six points. And in the horizontal side, we have seven points because one has been contributed by the first copy of six triangular number. So you have two copies of six triangular number, and they are representing six into seven points. So can we call that the six triangular number is nothing but six into seven by two? What about the nth triangular number? That is sum of first n natural numbers. So let's again imagine that you have two copies of nth triangular number and you have aligned them together to make it something like a rectangle. How many points are there in the vertical side. So you see that you have n sides because it's our nth triangular number. And what about the horizontal side? You have one extra from the first copy of nth triangular number which makes it n plus 1. So you have n rows and in each row you have n plus 1 points. So basically two copies of nth triangular number is building up a rectangle of n by n plus 1. So the nth triangular number is nothing but n into n plus 1 by 2.